As part of the Amateur Radio Foundation training course, you're required to complete a short Morse code appreciation practical. Today's amateurs aren't required to learn Morse, but it's important to understand the basics. I've been doing Morse code, so we've been um, transmitting and receiving. I've never dealt with Morse code before at all, but I quite enjoy it actually. This straightforward practical involves receiving and sending a short phrase in Morse code. The speed at which the, the Morse code is sent would probably be reduced down for somebody that's having a lot of difficulty uh, distinguishing the dots and the dashes because some people do find it difficult. In days gone by it used to be done at 12 words a minute, frighteningly fast. As time has gone on we've got down to about one word a fortnight now, very very slow indeed. No one has ever failed the Morse assessment. It's always tailored to the person, the individual, to make sure that they understand and make up a Morse code. As well as being a part of the Foundation syllabus, this practical serves as an introduction to Morse code. And many amateurs go on to learn and use Morse to communicate around the world.